I'm Bob Ronkerd, my wife Mary Ann, and we have a son, Neil, who's been a member of the LAD program now for a number of years. When he came on with LAD, it was 2017, and I came on as a part-time DSP on Saturday mornings and afternoons. Um, and from there, Neil and I kind of built a great bond of going out every Saturday together. So when there was extra shifts open, I was happy to jump in. Stephanie was very upbeat. I think her positive nature is what uh, really struck me. It also struck me that she was um, shared so much about what Neil did, what Neil said. We really felt part of it. We knew what, what she was interested in, what she enjoyed about Neil. Coming on with LAD in 2016, it was the first time I had ever been a DSP. Prior to that, I had worked in restaurants, so it was completely new to me. Just how she's impacted his, his personality, his, his joyfulness, his expressiveness. She's, she's a, interacts with him and he interacts back. I became Neil's full-time provider with HLAD because for myself and his parents, it seemed like the next best option. We were both very comfortable with each other. We were already together all the time. It was a challenge for Stephanie to say like, you know what, I can, I can do this. I can take Neil on full time. When she stepped back and really looked at like, you know, my daughter loves Neil and my son, and then just the fun that they were having together, I think that put her mind at ease. From the first time I met Neil, we didn't interact too much, but eventually we did like connect, get closer. So Neil's um, relationship with my family is a great, very loving relationship. When Neil sees my daughter, um, no one else in the world exists. He screams, he yells her name. When he sees my son, he's the same way. He's very energetic and excited to see them. I was actually more comfortable with the idea of moving in with Neil because it would make it easier for us to always be together and it didn't feel like he was overcrowding or anything. It just felt like he was a part of our family, but not fully. So us moving in together definitely helped with that. Neil definitely, like, I don't know, he's like a ray of sunshine. As much as I'd like to say, like, HLAD is a part of Neil's team or that the service and support administrator is a part of the team, like, no, Stephanie is the team, and we're all like the, the advocacy based on what Stephanie tells us to do. That's the best way I know to describe her and, and her advocacy for him and just being like his number one cheerleader. <laughs> I would describe my mom as loving, caring, and patient. I'm thrilled it, to see him having a good time with Stephanie and her family and just doing all the d different things that they do is just makes me uh, very happy and I'm thrilled. I'm the worrier. I think that's, I think that a mother's role is to worry. <laughs> but uh, so I've, I've always worried about Neil falling. I am less eager to do a lot of activities. I'm really happy that with Stephanie and her family, he's just out there. They're doing all kinds of things. Are you ready for vacation? Yeah. We're going to play in the sand? Yeah! We're going to make a sand castle? Ah. No way. His joy and excitement also brings me excitement, so I enjoy seeing Neil happy. He's more balanced now. He has more of a routine. And I feel like the constant company, it brings him joy too. The main thing that always sticks out to me is Live, Work, Connect. And I think Stephanie embodies that and that she makes sure that Neil lives his best life by staying connected to his family, his friends, and um, being out in the community. 
as much as possible, as much as he wants to. With all the folks that he's met through Stephanie, Neil's, you know, has expanded his worldview. Family means to me love, support, and joy. My mom has a lot of love to give, so I feel like that is why she deserves the award and why she's perfect for Neil.